Hello everyone, welcome back to ATP Creative Corner. In today's video, I am making this triangular pouch. Before we begin, please hit that subscribe button if you aren't subscribed already. I make a sewing tutorial every week. Okay, now let's begin. So whenever I go out with my toddler, I always keep a lot of candies and lollipops inside this triangular pouch and keep it in my handbag. You can also keep your earrings or lipstick or lip balm in this pouch and carry it with you. Now let's get started with the tutorial. First, I've taken a rectangular piece of main fabric and a lining fabric, both of same dimension. 6 inches across 9 inches. On the wrong side of the main fabric, I am going to place a canvas. You can use any other interfacing. You can also use thick old bed sheet. And I'll give a stitch on the edges. Once done, it will look something like this. Now it is nice and thick. For the handle, I have taken a rectangular piece of fabric whose width is 1 inches and length is 7 inches. Now I'll fold it in half with its right sides facing each other like this and give a straight stitch. Now it's done. Now with the help of a safety pin, I'm going to turn the right side of the fabric outwards. Now I'll give top stitch on both the sides. Now our handle is ready. For the pouch I have taken a zipper of length 6 inches. Now I am going to keep the right side of the zipper on the right side of the main fabric like this. And the lining fabric with its right sides facing downwards like this. I am using sewing clips to keep all of them in place. If you want to buy these sewing clips, I have given the link in the description box below. I will give a straight stitch here. Once done, it will look like this. Now, I will give a top stitch here. Top stitch is done. Now, on the other side of the main fabric, I am going to place the right side of the zipper downwards. And the right side of the lining downwards like this. I will place the sewing clips. And give a straight stitch here. Now it's done. Now I'll turn the right side of the fabric outwards like this. Now I'll give a top stitch on this side as well. Top stitch is done. Now I'll turn the fabric into its wrong side again. You can see here the main fabric and the lining fabric are on the either side of the zip. Now I'll make a notch at the center of the main fabric like this. Now I'll join the zipper and this notch mark on the main fabric. And I'll also join the lining fabric at the center like this. Here the zipper is sandwiched between the main fabric and the lining fabric. I am using sewing clips to keep them in place. Now I will give a straight stitch here. 
now it's done next i am going to fold the handle in half like this and i am going to place the handle inside the pouch right below the zipper such that the closed end goes inside the pouch like this i am going to secure it with the sewing clip now i'll give a straight stitch such that on the lining fabric i'll leave 2 to 3 inches gap unstitched now it's done now through this gap i'm going to turn the right side of the pouch outwards Lastly, I am going to sew this part by pushing the raw edges inside and giving a straight stitch. Now it's done. And the triangular pouch is ready now. You can see here there are no raw edges. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.